I'm Jules and I'm on Holby City and it's been a really, really good experience for me and it's been one of my favourite things I've been involved in. I have Asperger's which is a mild form of autism and it's been, it was very challenging at the beginning of Holby City because I was walking into something completely new and I was very apprehensive and nervous at the start. I really enjoy uh, being able to go into a different world when I'm acting, you know, forgetting the hectic outside world and going into a pretend hospital drama. It's a, it's a very nice feeling as an actor, actually. And it's really good to, uh, to uh, flirt with all the lovely makeup ladies when I'm not when I'm not on set, and because uh, they're all very friendly and nice, and but I, I always have such a great time when I'm there. Actually, I just always never want to go home really when I'm there. Well, there was a point where I was very frustrated with the industry because I was seeing all these films, all these movies that were about um, have had a character with a condition, and it was always played by a neurotypical person so often. It, you know, so many films like Rain Man and Black Balloon, and, you know, they're all, all, all the, the actors in those two movies don't have a condition and it's frustrating that directors and producers don't do enough research sometimes to actually look out there that, you know, there are people with conditions that can play these parts. I, I think the media industry could be more uh, inclusive. My advice would be to, um, to believe you can do it. Don't give up. Always believe, and then you'll make it. I'm Jules Robertson, and I'm the big story of Holby City, and I approve this message. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that's quite a... <laughs> <laughs>